Hello my darlings, this is Ruthie here. I wanted to talk to you today about a, an idea that we commonly come across in the society we live in. This is the idea of what the most important role of a human is. And many people believe that the most important thing a person can do is have a university education and get a good job and be a productive member of society and work really hard and make lots of money and live a good life. Um, as I keep saying to you, many lies are 90% truth. It is good to be educated. It is good to work hard. It is good to get wealthy so you have money to share with people who don't have the same strength as you. It is a blessing from God to be able to work and make money a decent wage for hard work. That's a blessing. However, there is a tenth percent to the lie that makes it a lie. It is not the most important thing you can do with your life. The most important thing you can do with your life, the Bible tells us, is love the Lord your God with all your heart and all your mind and all your soul and treat other people as though they were yourself. Be, be as kind to them as you would like other people to be kind to you. That doesn't necessarily mean do for them exactly what you would want people to do for you. It means be kind in a precise way. So you ask God to open your eyes to what sort of kindness they want and need and then you give it to them because what we ultimately want is we want to be understood and we want to be loved and we need that in different ways, don't we? So you need to find out from God exactly how you're going to do that for each person on an individual basis. But that's what I want you to remember. The most important thing in life is to know God and keep his commandments. And we get this from a king called Solomon who was very, very, very rich and very, very, very hardworking. He had it all. He was a major producer. And at the end of a beautiful book talking about all his success and everything he'd done called Ecclesiastes in the Bible, he summed it up by saying that of making many books, there is no end. And much study is a weariness of the mind. Let us have the conclusion of the matter. Fear God and keep his commandments, for this is the whole duty of man. And that is what you must remember, my darlings. Fear the Lord. And again, as I say, fear does not mean be afraid. It means respect him. Respect the Lord. Love the Lord. Seek his will. Be kind to people. And you will find yourself to be a very, very useful human indeed. There is no such thing as a useless person who is kind. Love you.